Hi, this is Mike Haber. Thank you for asking me, what is a conspiracy in Florida? A conspiracy is an agreement, express or implied, between at least two people, one of whom is not a cop or working for the cops, to commit a criminal offense, coupled with the intent that the crime be committed, regardless of whether the crime ever occurs or not. The crime of conspiracy is separate and distinct from the intended offense, meaning you can be prosecuted and punished for both the conspiracy and the completed crime. If you just aid or abet someone, or if you are merely present when a crime occurs, you have not committed the crime of conspiracy. Why? Because a conspiracy requires both a pre-existing agreement and the requisite intent to commit the crime. Like solicitation, it is irrelevant to a conspiracy charge that the intended crime never came to pass. But unlike solicitation, you cannot avoid a conspiracy prosecution by way of simple abandonment. In order to effectively withdraw from a conspiracy, the law requires you to actually prevent or persuade your co-conspirators from going forward with the crime. If you're convicted of conspiracy in Florida, the level of the offense will be determined by reducing the level of the intended crime by one. So if you had conspired to commit a first degree felony, the crime is a first degree felony, but the conspiracy is a second. If you conspired to commit a third degree felony, the crime would be a third degree felony and the conspiracy a first degree misdemeanor. Thank you for your question. I appreciate your having asked it. I invite you to ask me more. Please remember at Michael A. Haber PA, it is all about reasonable doubt. And if you like this video, please subscribe. We'll be putting out more. And that one more time or no? Yeah, let's run it one more time and then, I'm, and then I'll be comfortable. I gotta stop locking my hands. <clears throat> I know. All right, start it from the beginning. We got the speed is good, so what is it at? 16?